<laughs> Joining us right now, a guy that deals with all kinds of stuff that can kill you, especially a terrible insurance company that won't pay you if you've been in an accident. That's right. Sweet James Bergen, or my personal injury attorney, the dense beard of justice at 800 881 2021 is joining us right now on the Chevy Silverado Celebrity Hotline. It's Justice with Sweet James. Order in the court. Order in the court. It's time for Justice with Sweet James. Did that guy throw a drink at us? Yeah. Just threw a drink. And now EJ, you better run. EJ's going to get you. Yeah, EJ. You better get out of here, Slurpee guy. Now you better get him. Oh, don't get mad at us, EJ. He's the one that threw the drink. (laughs) Joining us right now. We sure could use his protection. It's Sweet James Bergener, the dense beard of justice. I can't take my eyes off the guy. Yeah, he's really something. Yeah. Uh, Sweet James, we absolutely love you. How's it going? I'm doing well. How are you, Petrus and Money? Uh, other than that a vagrant just threw a drink at us, we're, we're in great shape. <laughs> yeah, outside of that. We're having a good time. My man is part of the show. Just be out there in the elements. Make it part of the show. Can we sue him, Send Sweet James? Send EJ on that guy. Come on. Can we sue him? Can we sue a guy for throwing a, a half uh, half glass of beer at us? <laughs> do you want to? No. I don't. Yes. I do. I do. I no, so. I do, though. Yes. <laughs> Ultimately, I, I don't. You know what? Ultimately, sweet James, I was shocked that, you know, when, when I got through the security at the airport, I was shocked that they let me through, that I wasn't on some kind of watch list. Did you get me uh, some kind of free <laughs> passage here to the state of Nevada? And am I free to travel about the country with my pending legal issues that we've been talking about so much over the last few months? So far, you are free to travel about the country, Petros. You are you're free until the beginning of August when we have our hearing coming up. See, I like the uh, I like the but. You're free to travel, but there's a I hearing at the beginning of the August. I don't think I did. He's, Wait a he's minute. Fun. I feel like there was. I feel like there was a but there. You did say but. Is there <laughs> anything I should worry about with the thing in August to where I wouldn't be able to travel afterwards? Um, yes, there is. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Now we're no, talking who's got no, pokey. Let's no, go. This, this is you... what I'm talking about. So Petros here, we've got, a, we've, got, we've got a hearing in the beginning of August. Okay. I am going to be out of the country <gasps> when your oh next God. hearing is. How convenient. Now, if, now, last time I've handled everything. I got him paid That's when he right. got a ticket 10 years ago. I mean, I like, handle stuff. You literally had the state. Uh, and I like yes. to believe, you know, I, I hate to say it, but part of that is my money. I am a tax-paying <laughs> citizen of the state of California, <laughs> and that's who cut him that check. Well, I made sure yes. I called Gray Davis and made sure all of it was your money. <laughs> I feel like I contributed <laughs> to that. That's how good Sweet James is. A 10-year-old ticket, and somehow P gets a check. Yeah, but that's yes. water under the, the George Washington Bridge here at the New York, New York, <laughs> Sweet James. What, what do you mean I can't leave the country after August? No, you're going to be able to handle it. You're going to be able to leave. You're going to be able. To, you're going to be fine. It's just that I'm not going to personally handle this one for you. Maybe well, is I'm going to do it. Who's going to do it? I'm, I'm going to delay it again, and of course, then money will make a big joke out That's of right. That That's right. That's right. We got to table this. We got to table yeah. this. Yeah. Uh, I want to postpone because I want to handle this. P. Let me tell you something, sweet James. Those union presidents, when they kept kicking that can down the road for employee benefits, look what happened to the American <laughs> auto unions. Look what happened to them five years ago. You keep kicking that can, sooner or later you're going to have to pay. It's like the Iran nuke deals. <sighs> exactly. Oh, All right. Boy. Look, we'll just deal with it. Where are you going? Norway. <laughs> Come on. You just got back from Italy, and now you're going to Norway? That's the best answer to an honest question. Who the question. hell goes to Norway? Best answer to an honest question I've ever heard. Where are you going? Dot, dot, dot. Answer, Norway. Norway. Right, let's talk Norway. some real legal issues. Well, with why is he going to Norway? Why not? Who knows? He's probably got a car he's buying there. All right, let's talk legitimate legal issues, James. Let's do this. Before you go to Norway, hopefully you're not distracted about your pending vacation in Norway. All right. The Never guy sitting on my right shoulder. Is Sing Sing a possibility for oh, him? Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> what? That's a legitimate legal question. No, no, no. Okay, what about The Rock? Can we put him on The Rock? Yeah, they it's may reopen Closed for decades. For what? When did they close The Rock? <laughs> <laughs> What's next? Leavenworth? What? Leavenworth? Mm-hmm. Is, he going to, Bay? is he going to camp? Name them all. <laughs> come on. Folsom. Come on. Spit it out. Folsom. Folsom there maybe. you go. Rikers. That's where he's going. Rikers. Good luck getting off that island. (laughs) Isn't there some kind of fantasy football thing going on? Yeah. Tony Romo was supposed to uh, come to Vegas, sweet James. Oh, yeah, that's right. You can. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Giant convention. The NFL says no, so Romo claims. The NFL's kind of claiming no. How does that that work? Uh, I guess if you're an employee, we'll try to make it as applicable to our listening audience uh, as we can. You're an employee. Yes. Does not interfere interfere with your daily job, 
and you get an outside contract to go somewhere. Why, why are there legal issues with that? Why can your employer say no? You know, this is a weird thing. The NFL is acting a bit thuggish here. Ooh, I mean, they're, thuggish, they're canceling, thuggish bone? I mean, they're canceling this, uh, this uh, Tony Romo fantasy camp thing because it's in Vegas, because there might be some implications of gambling. Just, I'd like to see the NFL clean up their act here and get some stuff straight, but that's just, they're acting like they're players. What's up with that? They are very sensitive. I don't about, know what's uh, up with that, James. I, they, I can't are, tell you. you know? they, are, they are sensitive about the connection between gambling and the yes, they football are. league. Right. As, um, many, many suggest that maybe that's why the NFL is so popular, because of the, uh, the fantasy football and then the, right. the weekly gaming that uh, the people participate in. That's so, it? It's not the, as it, no, the no, heart and the, and the It's victory. not the violence? Yeah, it's not the heart and the victory of football. <laughs> Overcoming adversity. The sportsmanship and awesomeness. So no. can they do this or no? I mean, because does, does, Tony Romo's threatening to sue. Do you think he's got uh, some some legal ground to stand on? I think he does. I think he does. I hope he files this lawsuit. I hope he goes forward on this thing. I, I think he does. I mean, an employer, when you, when you get when you clock in, you know, you there, you have certain responsibilities and certain obligations. But outside of that, it's your life. And here Tony is like, I'm going to, me and my friends are going to show up in Vegas and we're going to sign some autographs. And then NFL says, no, you can't do that. That, that, that draws a line to me that uh, it's, I mean, they're threatening family, the NFL is threatening family members and the, the players themselves with suspensions and fines. Uh, I, I, I want to see this stopped. All right. Well, all right. The best yeah. news so far, other than that, that Tony Romo might have a case is, is that a cop in an armored Segway was able to chase away the vagrant who threw. Uh, yeah, a there we go. We didn't even need Sweet James. Order is restored. <laughs> All right, now let me give you another hypothetical situation, Sweet James. Okay. Let's say right around the time the 15 freeway blew up last week and all the cars caught on fire, that I was flying my drone around, checking out traffic, and it got in the way of like a fire helicopter. Am I going to get sued for flying that drone around? Here's the crazy thing. I mean, question. this is like this new. Thank new you. new thing to have drones and stuff. There's no real laws on that. Oh. You can't. It's the have Wild a, West. <laughs> it, 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 it really kind of is. I mean, there are FAA laws where you can't. I think you can't take it over like four thousand feet. But I mean, you know, if you're hovering around a few hundred feet and a chopper comes by, I don't know. It's going to be. It, there's no no laws are are on the books for this stuff yet. So we can fly our drones anywhere we want. I wouldn't, but uh, okay. Our you engineer can. in Vegas you can. says no. Says no. Says don't do it out here in Vegas, huh? All right. Uh, Cal- California, know, you know, there's 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 nothing on the books yet. Back in the day, there was a thing called the sponging house. It's where prisoners a sponge- were. Uh, wait, wait, a what? <laughs> sponging house. <laughs> okay. And, uh, it was a a tavern of sorts where persons arrested for uh, debt or just uh, innocent crimes, if you will, uh, were held for 24 hours before being lodged in uh, in a prison. Uh, okay. Is is P's situation <laughs> one that might dictate him going to a modern day sponging house at least for a few hours or something like that? P is a free man. Nah. That guy's why guys walk on the earth Stop happy the and Thank free. you. <laughs> All right, let's say another hypothetical on the fifteen uh, burning okay. down. Let's say I'm on the fifteen freeway and my car exploded. Just right. drive, trying to drive to Vegas here to New York, New York to have a great time and watch okay. the Petros and Money Show. And my car is now uh, a pile of ash. Can I sue? Can I sue the 15? Uh, Who do I sue there? Well, what are you driving? I don't know. I mean, it's I'm not, driving... it's not, it's not your Chevy Silverado. I know no, that. No, that wouldn't burn. Those, those no. cars are fire retardant. <laughs> but, but is there, if let's just say I was driving a Civic and it exploded, wh- who, yeah. who, who could I sue? You, you, uh, it's going to be, we're going to look at Honda. What the hell is the matter with that Civic? Wait a minute. It blew up on the 15 during that giant fire. Right. Why like did it blow fire... up? The, the fire engulfed the Civic. Right. It jumped oh. over the freeway and Blew my car up as I was driving to Vegas. We're we're gonna look at we're gonna look at the Civic to see if it meets the guidelines. <laughs> okay. Who started the fire? How long had it been there? It was always burning. It was always burning. <laughs> all right, all right. You know what? We just gotta put this to an end. Yeah, I think we do. Sweet James, it's Vegas. It's it, the strip has gotten <laughs> yeah, the best. And you know what? It got off crazy. to an inauspicious start with the guy lobbing the beer at our head. Yeah, that was a tough. Team. That was the problem. But you know what? The <laughs> We've best, been a bit distracted. The best part about it was it hit two girls and not Matt. And exactly. I. But we didn't mention that. We, we were protected. We wanted you to think we were in danger. Wait, Thank wait, you, Sweet the, James. The girls were walking by and they got hit. They took no, the hit no. For they you were guys? watching our show and yeah. having a great time, but now they're gone. Now oh. they're gone. All the chicks are gone now, man. Man, chased all the chicks out of here. 
800-881-2021. SweetJames.com or at Sweet James on Twitter. There's only one Sweet James Burger. The dead spirit of justice. We love you, Sweet James. Well, I love you guys. Have fun in Norway. Yeah, what the hell? <laughs>